you guys, Nicole Scott here from Mobile Geeks. I'm at Pepcom at CS 2019, and smart glasses aren't dead. They are very much alive and heading towards professional applications and not so much the consumer. However, Nintendo has actually backed these because they're hoping that, you'll, well, that you will consume entertainment on here and maybe even do a little bit of gaming. It is an AR glass, so the small projection is floating out towards infinity. You can see the tiny little projector here kind of putting a hmm, inch and a half by inch and a half square on, on this right lens. Now, if this is smartphone powered, which makes the glasses a lot lighter. So we can see the different applications that I can choose between. Remote, heads up display for directions, and then the entertainment application where I'm actually watching a movie now on this lens. I find it a little uncomfortable to watch a film that close, but it is an interesting uh, kind of take if you want to head towards uh, consumer apps. Now, we should be able to pick this up uh, in the second half of this year, I believe, under $500. So $499. And because it's heading towards business applications, I do believe that these guys are going to end up customizing them just a little bit when companies put in bulk orders. All right. Smart Glass is still alive. CES 2019. I'm your host, Nicole Scott from Mobile Geeks.